Janome. Hi, my name is Kelly McKenzie. I'm the long arm specialist here at Janome. I am going to show you today on the Quilt Maker Pro 20 how to bring your bobbin thread up when you get ready to start quilting, how to tie it off, and then how to end when you're finished with a section of quilting. The first thing you're going to always do is hold your top thread with your left hand. You will then select the needle up, needle down button on your left handlebar so that it brings your bobbin thread up to the top. I'm going to gently grab that. Now you can see that my bobbin thread is yellow and my top thread is a blue or a green, whatever color you think that is. And then I'm going to put my needle in the down position to get started. I will then select the star button that I have programmed to be my lightning speed tie-off stitch. And on my screen, I have that stitch set at four tie-offs. I will select that button and you'll see that is like magic how it tied off my stitch for me. Then I can start quilting. So I'm gonna press the start button on my right hand of bar. If I am done with that section, I will then again hit that lightning stitch tie off so it'll tie off my thread at the end of my quilting pattern. I will then hit the needle up button on my handlebar. I will move my machine far, far away. Sometimes you might need to give your machine a little bit of slack right here with the thread. I will bring it back to that area of where I stopped at. I will hit the needle up, needle down button again to bring that bobbin thread back up to the top. And that way I can snip my top and my bottom thread at the same time. And then I can move my machine to the next section that I would like to quilt.